Oh, oh, it's these. Well. Yes. Uh, tracking station. Go here for a minute. Yeah, there, there's literally nothing other than those debris. Which now missing one. But, oh, because I, oh, I get it now. Oh, wow. So, Dragoon Mark 1 was pretty good. Ran out of juice. Just as we see it into the space, though. Um, I'm gonna ditch these for that for now, and uh, what if I were to add in more of these? Doesn't make it one big bitch of a rocket. I think I'll just try this, see how far it gets, and then... Um... Yeah, yeah. We're gonna go ahead and add one of these. All those I wanted to play at the same time. Uh, then the... Outer ones, then the couple, then the inner one, and that one, and then my parachute, which I hope actually works this time. To the Dragoon Mark II. Save. Clear the launch pad. Okay. Let it load in. Oh, that's a little unstable. It's fine though. Whoa! Oh god. That was not working as intended if we're in front of this. Uh, you know what? Let's let's just end this fight. <laughs> uh, let's go back to the vehicle assembly building. Something went terribly wrong. I don't know how we. Oh, you know what? I want these up here. Then I want the engines on their own. Before that. That's that problem. Uh, the struts? Uh, should I add struts, maybe? Just so it's not... You know... Uh, structural.
and that should be good. I'm not adding one to this because I don't know how it'll react when they break off. I'm actually not sure how this is going to react when they break off. Because, <laughs> you know, they're all attached to one another. This is in the center. Uh, so yeah, well, we'll keep this on the mark too. I didn't make any significant changes. Uh... Let's try it. It's a little laggy when it's first spawned in. Okay, we're gonna turn up the throttle. Turn on SAS. Start up the spring free. I knew that wasn't going to end well. I mean, granted, once the first rock took off, it probably would have been fine, but it would have made it far anyway. So I, uh... I saved my little buddies. <laughs> the landing gear broke, yay. <laughs> They're alive, though. You know, Bob Kerman, Jebediah Kerman, and Bill Kerman are all, uh... all safe and sound. By the looks of it, the nose cones get stuck. I don't know how the fuck that's possible, but anyway. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it got stuck. So. We'll end this flight. <laughs> Go to the vehicle assembly building. Um. We'll attach it to... Oh, wait. God damn it. Uh, structural... Or we'll actually attach it to those this time. Uh, again, save, launch, clear debris. I like how you keep the same crew for all your missions, providing they don't die. It, it just means more to me when these same Kerbals are making it through all this. Uh, so anyway, let's try this again. There we go. see what we're doing here.
Okay, I wanna... Brings it in, I don't wanna bring it in. Uh, that's, I don't care about that. I'd like to bring it out more. Too much, way too much. I just have to hmm. I don't know how this will work, but uh, I know turn off the SAS. I gotta aim towards that, I believe. Could be wrong, but... I don't, okay. I wish these had markers, because I really don't know which one I'm aiming for. Might actually be the yellow one. So, uh, we'll speed up time just a little bit. I can get out there a little quicker. Just here a little bit more again in preparation for the burn. Okay. Turn that way. It's not the easiest, but it's also not the hardest thing in the world to control. And burn. 